Okay, so uh, here we are. We're going to demonstrate how a vapor injector works on a two-cycle engine. This is my uh, 1969 Subaru 360 van, and it's running. Let's see, I'll rev it up here for you. And uh, we have our water bottle here. When we turn the vapor ejector on, we just open the little air line like this, and you'll see bubbles start to form in the bottle. See that? That means it's working. What happens is, is it's drawing air through this little tube here, or the vacuum of the engine is pulling air through the bottom, through the sponge, which is not immersed in the water, and then going in the engine. It helps cool the cylinders and give it more power on, on uh, hot days. These engines um, have a hard time cooling themselves, especially if you increase the compression. So that's our little tutorial. Put it in here. I'll figure out a way to zip tie it or strap it. There you go. And then if it's a cold rainy day like it is today, you just turn it off. Simply just shut the valve and you'll see the bubbles will stop bubbling. Look at that. The amazing thing is it hardly uses any water. Alright, see you later.